uh, Rudy Carson here, Arrowhead Flangler. Yeah, I decided to try to hit the NAM. So I'm on the NAM up by uh, northern Wisconsin in uh, Hayward. And the fishing's been pretty good. Been getting a lot on uh, double nymph rigs, and uh, surprisingly, I've been getting a lot of uh, on an olive and uh, green woolly bugger. I'm going to show a, a few pictures of that too while I'm here. It's pretty windy outside, a little cool, probably in the mid 40s or something like that. Just game overcast. There's actually quite a few, quite a few stone flies coming off, or at least getting knocked down by the wind into the water. But I don't see any fish rising, so it's a little bit too cold for that right now. Once it warms up, probably a few degrees. It'll probably be biting pretty good on the surface. All right, check you guys later. Bye. There. I was able to find a really nice run here. I missed a few fish you can see from the video and managed to tag in a few nice ones. Probably the biggest one was probably around uh, 14 inches or so. I'm sure there's some more fish in there. So I'm going to get back to it and uh, do some more nipping. I'll show you what I'm using here in a little while. I don't know how this is going to work out, but all I have is my uh, Sony camcorder. So I'm going to try to hold it in one hand and fish with the other hand and see how it goes. I'm going to be fishing this stuff right behind me. It's a good run. A lot of fish stacked right in there. Oh, dang. You probably can't see it on the camera. Unless you got some polarized. There's a fish. But there's a little ledge right there. It drops down to about three, four feet. I'm just fishing right on the edge. It's kind of hard to see without polarized glasses on though. Yeah, nice little brownie. All right. I got to let you go. That right there is a stone fly. 
Winter Stone. Hey, all right. Uh, yeah, for one thing, I, I apologize for not having a lot of fishing video. Uh, the battery is dying really quick, so I'm gonna try to get a little bit of uh, some fishing in here. I'm gonna be tossing this uh, woolly bugger. I did two things wrong today, or actually three. I forgot to charge up the camera batteries, and I forgot the tripod, so that sucks. And then I forgot my lunch. But the fishing has been good, so I forgot about eating, but now I'm starting to get hungry. So hopefully I can try to fish while I'm filming with my one hand. <laughs> fishing with my lefty. This looks like a good piece of real estate right here. It's definitely got to be fish right here. Okay, here we go. Hopefully I can get a fish before the battery dies. There you go. Got him. All right, this is going to be a trick. Film in one hand. Definitely got to invest in some GoPros. There you go. Wooly bugger right in the mouth. That's where you want it to be. Over and out. Hey, I'm back. Uh, yeah, sorry it took me to a little bit there to get back to this, uh, but uh, my battery is dying really fast, so I got to make this really quick. I'm going to show you what I was using today. Uh, I did really good, surprisingly, on the woolly bugger, the olive ye yellow woolly bugger, and I'll show those right now. And I was also using a tandem nymph rig. One of them's a Missy D, basically a tungsten weighted uh, black uh, size 10 nymph, and then a smaller size 16 nymph. Something dark, that's basically what it comes down to. So here, here it is. That's the woolly bugger right there. And those are the two nymphs. As you can see in the background, the, the clouds started picking up. It's just windy out here. It's starting to get a little chilly, but it's not too bad. Uh, I haven't still haven't seen any surface activity at all, but there's quite a few uh, stones on the surface. They're probably getting blown down from the wind out of the trees. Uh, there's quite a few stones still crawling around the snow here. So it'll just pick up. Uh, water's still pretty chilly. Um, yeah, get out here uh, on Namakagan. Pretty fun river to fish. Probably one of my favorite ones. Easy to wade and easy to fish. All right, till next time. Later, bye.